Hi, everybody. Kathy Holmeyer here. Uh, good evening. Um, at the moment, this is being broadcast at Easter time, a little bit at 6 o'clock in the evening. So hello, hello. Um, please say hello and let us know you're there. Um, today, we're going to do a little bit of 12 body system support. I'm going to do, um, I'm going to combine a little bit of lightweight, a little bit of essential oils, um, and see where it takes us. So if anybody would like to see what 12 body system uh, they're in need of energetic support with today, go ahead and type that in. Um, I'll go with that first and say that you're here. Uh, hi, Amber. Hello. How are you? Uh, let me hide that. So, um, I'm going to type in if anyone wants to see what 12 body system, meaning like circulatory, digestive, endocrine, all those types of systems they need with assistance with today. Uh, so what 12 body system needs support today. Then go ahead and type that in. And the, your first folks, well, hello there. Um, first folks will get uh, to know what I'm doing here. And there's Amber, hello, and Sean, and Anise, is that how you say that? You know, we were looking at um, crazy. Okay, uh, there you go. Um, we were looking at um, some family tree stuff. There was a person in our history, their first name was Experience and Exercise, and by God, how crazy is that? Okay, so... Um, Okay, so I got some folks who that we can start with, and then we'll ask them where you. Okay, so the first ones will know what I've said. So thanks for coming in. Um, first stop, and I just want to tell some tell you folks about other people are coming in too. Um, uh, let me have that. Okay, uh, we're gonna hide that. Bring up the agenda in November of twenty. What year is this? Twenty nineteen. I am going to have my first nutritional energetics. Um, that should go up there. It should be showing. There we go. My first nutritional energetics institute at my Lake Clear Lodge and retreat. So this is going to be an on-site conference, a nutritional energetics um, uh, 9D program. Hi, Tony. A 9D program of intensive, uh, good food, um, beautiful portal on the lake, uh, energetics plus culinary. And um, I'm going to go for it and offer a uh, institute in November. So if anybody is interested in coming to the Adirondacks in November, some of the Akashic Academy folks are going to get first dibs and um, special rates. So if you're somebody who can travel in November, um, you may want to, um, and like what I do, want to connect with everybody, uh, we may want to consider uh, November. And uh, we'll try and get as many Akashic Academy folks here as we can as well. So that would be really cool. So I'm preparing that for November. Hey, George, uh, Georgia, how are you? And I said hi to Tony. So let me go back, and we are doing some 12 body system support today. And what I'm doing is, because I like to look at our consciousness and healing and energetics within kind of a nine, um, a nine level, nine dimension, whatever you want to call it. I know people, you know, think of dimensions in different ways, but nine levels of consciousness. I'm going to do a little bit of that today with essential oils, with 12 body systems, with light wave. And with essential oils as well. Now, essential oils, obviously, you can do the essential oil itself or the number, lots of different things. If you've been with me before, then you know the different levels, the different ways that I like to bring in the frequency of everything. Hey, Carla. Um, if anybody wants to put where they're from, too, I'd love to know where you guys are from. So, uh, also, I am going to be launching my... Uh, Nutritional Energetics Cooking Academy, which will be online cooking classes, about four classes a month, uh, online support and one-to-one -one support and some live support. I really love doing my, my nutritional energetics and playing with food and bringing in the energetics. So I guess a lot of announcements here, that's here today, but information on how to take part in the Nutritional Energetics Cooking Academy. Um, it's cooking for light workers. It's basic cooking. 
even our first class is knife skills. Three knives, three cuts, you're good to go, and you can make good food. So, oh, we got Arizona and Georgia. Hi, everybody. Um, um, Haverville, Mass. Not sure where that is. My daughter lives in Massachusetts. And we're actually probably heading over to, um, actually, to, is it tomorrow, Wednesday? We're heading over to, um, how do you get the scrolling info on live? I'm not sure what that means. Um, uh, oh, Canada. Hello there. Um, heading over to, where is it, Vermont, to look at a college. But anyway, my daughter lives in Massachusetts. So um, anyway, so essential oils. We did essential oils last time. And in the comments, I'm going to put the uh, link to that show because we did a little bit on essential oils and uh, dowsing and things like that. Uh, I know a lot of you use essential oils. And I guess just one more announcement before we do some readings. Uh, let me see where that went in the agenda somewhere. Where did I find that? There it is. Um, oops. <laughs> I'm backwards today. Uh, where's the next one? If any of you don't use essential oils or haven't signed up yet, this is Young Living, and I absolutely love Young Living. Um, this month, if you sign up as a new member, you actually get thieves cleaner for free, which is awesome. I mean, you want to get rid of some low vibes in your house, start cleaning with thieves cleaner. And not only cleans really well and smells really cool, um, sometimes I put it in my rug shampoos and get high vibe all over the house and infused water. So if you, if you ever use uh, rug shampoos, put infused water in them as well as essential oils. Um, and like I said, sometimes I use these cleaner itself and you get high vibe all around your house, all around the room because you're you're uh, shampooing the whole Hey, Christy, you're shampooing uh, the whole the whole rug. So that's another way that around the house I use essential oils and infused water. I used a, a cleaning um, infused water from Peter Shanks Aquaware one time and it even cleaned the darn rug shampoo. So it was pretty amazing. Um, but if you don't do essential oils already and want to sign up, um, it does support me. Um, peppermint oil is awesome, Amber. Yep. Uh, that is my link to sign up to Young Living, and you get free uh, thieves cleaner um, if, when you buy the essential pack. But anyway, okay. And, okay. Yeah. Um, you know, there's other great essential oils out there, but if we do make sure, especially for cooking, because I cook with essential oils. Make sure you use a high quality oil and um, some of them have nano in there and I know there's different things that nano is used for, some good, some bad. As far as I know, Young Living does not have that, but the spinoff does. So anyway, okay, so let's go back. Hey, Jamie, let me see if I can go back down here and find uh, the folks who came on first because we're going to do some readings. And um, I see Sean and Amber, and hopefully I don't forget anybody that came on first there and said yes. If I do, ping me, and I'll try and get that later because I'm, <laughs> I'm always jabbering, and I kind of miss people. But I love to say hi to you, and I love to um, thank you for coming in to here because uh, this, these are fun, but there's, I, I, um, I try and uh, do what I can with them, and they're a lot of fun. Another thing I want to uh, show you before I start. Um, Mother's Day presents. They are, thank you for sharing, Lynn, um, Marie. Thank you so much. Uh, these are essential oil diffuser earrings. Um, so I just wanted to show you with essential oils, like I said, our last, uh, my last show last week was about essential oils, and we did some crazy things with those and did numbers and everything. About there's essential oil diffusers, um, earrings. And I'm sure people know about the diffusers that you can do for a room. And I don't know if people have seen like the jewelry and things that you can wear, probably if you're into essential oils. This is, oh my goodness, thank you. I feel so much better after the liver clearing you did on me. I could tell you a story about a liver cleanse I had on me too. Um, this is an essential oil diffuser too, a piece of clay, um, but it will suck in the essential oil and you can wear it around your neck. Uh, these earrings, obviously, you wear on your ears. So if you really want to get the aromatherapy therapy as well as everything, then there's even things like this really cool stuff that you can uh, that really can augment the use of your essential oils. Um, OK. So let's go. I know I've done 12 body um, support before, but we're also going to combine essential oils. 
And if you don't have the essential oil, then put that in the, sometimes I, I, miss, I miss the comments in there. Um, and so I'm going to give you my email too, guys. Um, that's my Young Living thing. I'm going to put this up too. Support at nourishing90.com because I do do private sessions. I do have classes once in a while. Thank you so much for sharing, um, Georgia. Uh, there's my email. In case we miss, um, if you're on the show now and you miss the frequency codes, I saw that question come up to uh, share the group. Thank you. Frequency codes. Well, two ways to get frequency codes. I'll answer that question first. Two ways to get them are to support Lloyd Mears work and buy his wonderful energy balancing by numbers book. Um, yeah, people seem to really resonate with codes. I mean, it's, uh, because you can tell, you know, radio frequency, frequency, we're kind of in, in tune with frequencies. Uh, the other way you can get it is to, I'll type this in. So either uh, codes, you can do Lloyd Mir balancing by numbers. And there's even essential oil codes that I was putting my email up because if we miss, uh, I'll, I'll uh, put those in the, hey, Cindy. Um, the other one is, and I do make custom codes occasionally for people who request them or need them for a specific. Um, I think it's www. Yeah, thank you. Jamie's typing stuff in. Thank you so much. Um, Anahata. I think it's anahatacodes.com, and she uh, does a free download. You have to, you know, put in your email, I think. But those are free codes. They're a little bit different. Uh, Lloyd Mir codes are basically a lot of them are codes um, that are in the body blueprint itself. Anahata codes have a ton more things outside the body, like trees and essential oils and animals and things like that. So a little bit different, even though Lloyd's um, has as much too. If you're interested more in the body, body uh, frequencies and blueprint, I would do Lloyd Mears. Anahatas are a free download, and you can use those as well. And I do have classes on how to use frequency codes. I do group classes because some people just want a little bit of support and how to use the codes and how to infuse the codes, how to infuse waters with those, that sort of thing. So I, I do those classes as well. So I'll just leave my email support up here too because so I've got some different classes coming up uh, yeah support support at uh, nourishing 90 and then we'll do some readings here because time always goes so fast dot com okay so that's my email if you have if you if you like some of the stuff that I do and want to know about even the um my well, three things tonight: Nutritional Energetics Institute in November, um, the essential oils, um, and uh, any of my classes and uh, private sessions. That's my email. Okay. And let me try and go back down here. Um, okay. And again, if you were one of the first ones that come in to say you wanted. Um, support then email me if I miss you um, okay oh, you okay Amber I think and Sean well Amber and Sean will start with you and usually and then this will be good for everybody too that have some issues but Amber okay okay where did all my all my tools go there they are okay so we'll start with identifying the 12 body system that you that is um, uh, the one you most need support with. Oh, your email didn't show. Uh, it, sh it should be showing there right now. Support at nourishing90.com. On my end, it it shows that it's showing. Um, let me put that back up. It's showing on this end. Anyway, it's support at nourishing90.com. Uh, Thank you for, for asking or saying that. Um, okay, so Amber, uh, what is the 12 body system you most need support with today? Hey, Stephanie. Uh, let's see, is it let's see, is it above my hand? No, below, is it reproductive? Muscular. 
muscular. Okay, getting muscular for you, Amber, and this is with the light wave, which we'll go ahead and start. If you can see this poster on way, this poster behind me here, that's the light wave poster. And um, uh, it, it's really cool. But anyway, just so you know what you're seeing behind you, that's some light wave energy too. So for muscular is royal blue, the color royal blue. So anybody who's having any muscular sort of uh, aches and pains, twinges, um, sprains, issues, let's bring in some royal blue color for muscular for everybody on the show today and listening in the future. So I'm picking up the royal blue and sending over uh, that to our muscular system. We're focusing on the muscular system with the royal blue. And I always tell people uh, energy work is always a good thing to do in like the frustrating times when you're waiting for something like in the grocery store or in you know traffic jam. Think of these colors and just send them to your systems. And you're always you can always give yourself a little energy boost. OK, muscular. And let's see, Amber, um, before uh, what was the percentage? Uh, how happy was your muscular system before over 10? Over 10 percent. Yeah. OK, so you needed some little support in there. So we're sending over some royal blue to your muscular system. Now, while I'm sending this, the essential oils that are good for muscular and skeletal um, got a little chart here, which is really cool, is frankincense. Of course, frankincense is wonderfully high vibe. Uh, peppermint vitality and marjoram, actually, according to this one. Um, and the ninja red, if anybody's familiar with Young Living, they have the ninja red, which is the wolf berries. So those are the ones that is the essential oils for muscular support. Okay. So let's see. So for Amber, um, so how happy is your muscular system now? Over 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, over 60? Okay, yeah. Um, Amber, let me know if you have any muscular things going on um, because it was, uh, when I get, when I say what's the, how happy is it, it means how often optimal function. Um, and we went up to 60, so yeah, keep on spiraling that around yourself. Um, if there's something actually physically going on or if we're catching something in the energetic realm. That's always really cool. Okay, Sean. Uh, so what system is the most important for Sean to attend to today? Is it, um, I'll just read this system. Is it nervous system, uh, integumentary, skeletal? Skeletal, is this true? Is this true? Okay. Yeah, and any feedback if you have, you know, any issues that were, um, so that were, like I said, energetic or other. So skeletal for Sean. So this is Indian red color for light wave. So I'm sending over some Indian red for the skeletal system for Sean and for everybody who wants to receive an Indian red infusion for their skeletal system for nice strong bones. And um, I, uh, I tend to be... Uh, do a lot of research on bones and teeth because of the calcium. And I hope you guys know that calcium is actually not what we need if we need stronger bones. It's actually, oh boy, we had a storm earlier too, Cindy. <laughs> Stay safe. Stay dry. Um, it is actually the silica and different things like boron. Uh, so skeletal is not always about the calcium. It's about different things. I've had uh, teeth issues from day one and uh, skeletal and bone. And of course, now we can, uh, people do regrow teeth, which is amazing. Working on that one. Okay. And for the skeletal system is the same, well, muscular in terms of the chart, I have the essential oils, frankincense, peppermint, marjoram. And of course, there's lots of different ones depending on the issue you're working with. But the other thing that I really love, and I don't know if you guys have, if you have essential oils, there's a book. Um, called the ultimate balance and that actually relates the vibrational energy of essential oils into chakras meridians and organs so it's a really cool complete book that shows the points to put the essential uh, oils on the meridians that run through them and it's really cool it combines essential oils more than just aromatherapy but right into the um uh, you know, chakras and meridians and that sort of thing, too. Today, we're working with the 12 body systems, 
with essential oils, but there's all, you know, of course, so many to me they really are the interface between our 3d and you know 560 area in vibration so they're really cool okay um, hello I do uh, Galliana will ask which system is best for you and so which system is best for Galliana today for support is it um, let's start at the bottom here is it the immune system is it the lymphatic system? Okay, lymphatics, that's always a great one for everybody. So the lymphatic system is a lime green. So I'm picking up a lime green color, kind of like a nice bright um, ripe lime and sending over a lymphatic um, lime green frequency. Chakra, is that what you're saying? Am I saying that wrong? <laughs> I probably say a lot of things wrong, but that's cool. Um, hey, Tony. Uh, let's see. We said to hi to Tony before, I think, on the, on the other stuff here. Okay, anyway, we're going to keep sending over some lime green. And then for the lymphatics, uh, lymphatics, essential oils for lymphatics are uh, citrus fresh vitality, uh, the lemon vitality the lemongrass, and the Juva Flex. Now, um, if anybody wants to write those in while I'm saying that some of those essential oils, I'll find some of the frequency codes for those as well. So if you want to type those into the comments for me so I can go down through and try to remember where we were at, I'm going to look up the Lloyd Mirror codes or the Ahadas or the essential oils and some other support. Um, I'll type in some numbers for support for the lymphatics. So far we did lymphatics, the skeletal, uh, system well, so, and the muscular system. Yeah, and you know when I do, well, especially when I do light waves, but when you do any kind of energy work or sending energy or healing or just trying to feel energy through your hands, um, then put some essential oil on your hands and open those hand chakras too. So that's a really cool thing to do. Uh, chakras are so cool. <laughs> Carly, go work on me anytime. Um, I have so much fun with this stuff. I mean, it's 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 crazy that we all need such support a lot of times, but I just love the work uh, and learning lots of things. Gotten way too deep in this stuff. I do do the emotion code as well. So the emotions and the essential oils go together too. So I'm actually going to be doing a program with emotion code and essential oils, um, and then the 12 body system with the essential oils and um, some energetics as well. Okay, so we sent some lime green and said about the essential oils. Yeah, I don't have time to kind of uh, look at those and type them all in, but I will try and get some in after the show is over. Okay, um, let me go back down. And uh, get Sean, get Carla. And again, email me if I at support at nourishing 90 if I don't get you today. If you're on the show today, if you're live on the show today. Um, okay, Ruina, alrighty. Yeah, because Christy's got the colors too, so she, I see her typing some in there. Okay, so Rowena, let's go for um, what support could Rowena um, use today, which is the most important 12 body system to support today. Uh, is it the nervous system? Is this true? Okay, that's the first one, so double checking. Yeah, nervous system is canary yellow. So let's send some canary yellow to uh, Rowena's nervous system, well, as well as everybody's nervous system who would like to receive a beautiful canary yellow frequency for your nervous system. And the other thing that I do like to check in, and didn't mention um, beforehand on sending frequencies to, is to check your multidimensional integration system to make sure all that's open. So let's just command whoever wants their multidimensional integration system. That's the system that can accept frequencies, that's open to accepting frequencies. We'll open that for everybody on the call today and listening. Generally, it's kind of like in parallel to your, um, your own, you know, um, it, it, you're eating your esophagus. Um, but you're actually intaking frequencies instead of food. So that's really cool. So we just want to make sure that that's optimally um, available to accept and assimilate the frequencies that we're sending. 
and it will do that to your own uh, to your own level of being able to take that in. And so all you have to do is put a little um, intention there, and that will do that. So we're sending over canary yellow for the nervous system. So essential oils for the nervous system would be frankincense. Again, um, really cool uh, vetiver, which I've never had. Had a lot of them, but not that one. Peppermint, uh, brain power. Uh, cedarwood and lemongrass. <laughs> yeah, I know we could all stay in this right now. I know everybody's kind of tired and kind of um, uh, had a lot of people go, oh my gosh, what's going on? But you know, that's the that's the wave of what we're in right now too. And I think just our awareness is better, so we go with the wave a little bit more because we're more aware of things. So the I think the essential oils always um, really assist and help us. Okay. So we get some nervous system with canary yellow, sending that through. And I'll try to look up a number for or the essential oils for that as well. Okay. And let's do one more. Um, Yeah, and we were saying she has peppermint oil in your hair. You can make so many products with essential oil. It's it's not even crazy, right? Yeah, and thieves. Uh, yeah, the liver. Um, Carla, just the liver. Um, uh, there was somebody who said, oh, your liver's really clear. We were working on each other and said, oh, your liver's really clear and came to my gallbladder. And they're like, oh, my gosh. So uh, it, it's really interesting when you actually just kind of feel into the organs and you actually get feelings from them and the emotions and um, your hands kind of, it, it's really cool when you really just want to tune in on, on something. And I love the light wave too, because it's just, it's color, it's color here. So that is really easy and wonderful as well. Um, okay. Yeah, and somebody's made a chakra. Um, was it you, uh, Amber? Let me just lift that up. You made a chakra bracelet with some lava stone. Yeah, but anything that's kind of um, that soaks a liquid in, right? You can use as an essential oil. Um, okay. So frequency codes as well. I think we got that. All right. Uh, I think somebody up here said they wanted a reading. Am I missing you? His usual time goes so fast. Uh, just going through the, um, oh, sorry, I didn't, um, sorry about that. Christy told me I had something scrolling on the bottom. I don't see that, so I don't know <laughs> what I had up there, guys, but. And, okay, Azrael, okay. So we'll do one more for Azrael. Uh, what system um, needs the most support? Is it, let's see one, if there's one that we didn't do or one that we did, respiratory, no, nope. uh, circulatory, is this true? Is it true that circulatory is next? Okay, circulatory is a beautiful fuchsia color, so a nice bright pink. So let's send over some, uh, fuchsia for the circulatory system for Azrael and anybody who would like to uh, receive fuchsia for their circulatory system, upgrading and updating. Um, any systems that we've done would be the colors would be upgrading, updating, um, improving flow of the system, releasing blocks, upping the vibe. So you can use these colors anytime. Actually, you can wear the colors. Um, I was trying to find my uh, scarf that I use that have all the light wave colors. But any color you really want in your field, the frequency you want in your field, then wear the color that day. So you can eat the color, you can wear the color, right, to get the frequency into your field. So right now we're sending over fuchsia for the uh, circulatory system. And then circulatory system, let's see, is that there? Uh, circular system it, um, essential oils. I don't see that on my chart. Oh, cardiovascular. So cardiovascular anyway. So cinnamon bark is good for cardiovascular. 
<laughs> you're holding a fuchsia agate. You know, more often than not, things happen like this when we do that. Isn't that awesome? Where's your comment? I just saw that pop up. There you go. Awesome. You know what you're see? Your body even knows what you need. Isn't that awesome? That's cool. Things like that happen every once in a while, and I, I just love it. You can't make this stuff up. Okay, so cardiovascular, cinnamon bark, uh, lavender, which is, of course, wonderful for any kind of toning down, evening out. Uh, somebody made me a beautiful lavender linen spray, and I forget what's in it, but it's different than just putting the lavender in the, um, or she said it in there, but I just love it. And uh, Brian DeForest, who does the light wave certification, says to spray lavender on your bed after you get up. Um, because then it then it um, you know clears your bed for a good night's sleep before and some I mean sometimes I'll do it just before we go to bed too. My husband's a terrible sleeper. So cardiovascular uh, clove as well for cardiovascular and you can cook with this too. If you cook with them, please be careful. They can ruin a dish really really fast and cook with high vibe. But um, okay. And again, if I missed anybody, just email me at support at nourishing 90. Or if you have any questions on um, the uh, any private sessions that I do, I'm looking at my agenda here. Um, if you don't have essential oils already, you get free thieves cleaner. It will be the month of sign up if you don't already have the basic kit. It's awesome. Totally worth it. Everything is uh, an investment, but this is truly an investment because they last forever and you can do so many things with them. And it really, if you do energy work, it really supports the energy work too. Yeah, you're welcome for the info. Um, I just saw another come up there. Circulatory is funny. I can feel my blood. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Cool. Um, yes, and thank you so much, Jamie, for uh, writing, writing in all these things. I really appreciate it. It helps because I forget what I say. And if I put them up on the screen, they just kind of disappear. Uh, let's see. One more emotional support. Of course, which essential oils are great for all the emotions. Let's just kick that into emotional support. Joy, of course, if anybody's had the Joy essential oil, I think that's one of my favorite fragrances from the Young Living uh, release. There's Transformation, which is really cool. The Citrus Fresh. Uh, bergamot, I actually use, and i got to tell you what I do with bergamot. I'm even going to type it in. Uh, put a drop, I'm going to take this in, of essential oil. If you guys drink coffee, in your coffee, your coffee grounds or your coffee beans. No matter what we do, there's usually mold on that stuff, even when we buy organic. It will keep them fresh. They're anti-fungal, fungal, anti-bacterial, um, that sort of thing. So put a drop of essential oil uh, in your coffee beans, your coffee grounds if you drink coffee. Uh, not to change the flavor so much, but give it a, um, yeah, joy, I love. Um, just to give it the, uh, well, I love bergamot, so I love um, uh, the bergamot, a little bit of a bergamot essence that it gives to the coffee beans when I grind them up, and it keeps them fresh. It's another thing to do with essential oils as well. So, and next week, don't miss next week because I'm having a heart, a guy who, um, yeah, close to my heart because I have somebody with uh, a young guy with heart issues. He uh, likes telling about high-functioning um, high hearts, and uh, he comes from a little bit of a different sort of thing. He's a chiropractor, and I think a naturopath, so don't miss next week. It's going to be awesome to talk to him, and uh, we'll have him coming up. So thanks for uh, coming in. Oh, yeah, cinnamon oil and coffee. Yeah, and put it, but, yeah, actually, you can brew it now. It, with the heat, it might take away a little bit of the effects, but it keeps everything fresh in the meantime. So that's really cool. And sometimes if I, in my restaurant, if I make a large, if we have a big, large thing of coffee, and I keep that for myself in the next couple of days, then I'll dump it down the drain, then I'll put a little bit in there, too, to keep it nice and fresh. So have a, a stay nourished out there, everybody. And have a great week. My uh, replays are on Sunday afternoons, which this will be if anybody wants to see it again or share that with somebody. Um, and then also I'm very much looking forward to talking to uh, Dr. Hutting next week about heart um, issues. So that's going to be really cool. Stay nourished out there, everybody. Take care.